What's the vlog without a trip to Target, right? <laughs> guys what's up and welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here hello and welcome to you yes baby uh, milkshake. milkshake okay I'm Anissa and this is my little love bug Rylan and today we are giving you guys another day in the life of a stay-at-home mom vlog you guys I am currently in the Starbucks line because your girl needs to pick me up I don't know what's going on yes baby you want milkshake? Yeah. Milkshake, milkshake, milkshake. I want, I want milk. Okay, milkshake. I am super tired. Extra tired. And we actually got Ryan, Ryan, we actually got Ryland to bed on time last night. So I don't know what's going on, but your girl needs to pick me up. So I'm in the Starbucks line. And of course, she's asking for a milkshake. So we're gonna jazz something up for her, get her a little milkshake. <laughs> Today's gonna be kind of a chill day, relaxing day. We're gonna see how this coffee does my body. But yeah, I got some laundry to do, some things to do around the house. So yeah, you guys, if you're new, please hit that subscribe button. If you haven't already liked this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up because I mean, why would you wait? Oh. Okay. <laughs> but anyways, you guys, let's get into this day. Your milkshake good, baby? You like it? Is it good? Okay, you guys, so we actually made it back home and Rylan is laying down for her nap. It's like taking everything in me not to lay down with her. I'm still super tired. But I have a lot of things to get done. I figured I'd go ahead and get a jump on the laundry while she sleeps so I can run up and down the stairs. And then um, we had a package from Amazon came in while we were gone. I'll probably put that together. It's JoJo's gaming chair. So I'll be able to put that together and put that in his room today. And yeah, let's stop jibber jabbering. Let's get into these chores. <laughs> time to myself which is rare in mommy world but I fixed myself a little snacky snack and I'm waiting for the laundry to finish up and I'm just tired you guys like I don't know do you ever have those days where you just feel like not doing anything like I don't put no makeup on I don't want to do my hair I just want to like chill you know that's how I'm feeling today I don't even want to fold this laundry up <laughs> so it's gonna wait that's how I feel um but also I'm kind of just like brainstorming content that I want to do you guys I have a lot of like different things that I would like to do on my channel but I'm not sure exactly what you guys want to see so drop down in the comments below if you have any type of content you would like to see myself and Rylan create or just myself. You guys know I love doing DIYs and I was supposed to start my table back in November, my dining room table back in November and I just never got around to it. But now that I got Rylan's bed out of the way, I'm also doing Jojo's room. I'm making over his room, but once I get done with that, I think I'm going to have time to do my dining room table. I've been looking at like some different looks and stuff. I'm still very inspired by the one that I saw at Ikea and I am going to be doing my color scheme like that light wood with that chalk black. I really like that look and I think it would go really good in our home with those with our like our dark wooden floors. 
So yeah, I think I am going to start on that. But also I had some um, floral inspiration. I want to do a floral arrangement, but it's not going to be like your average florals. Like I want to do a dried floral arrangement. I've been seeing so many different baby shower pictures and the floral arrangements are to die for you guys. And they're all dried floral arrangements with like roses and stuff. So I think I am going to tackle that, do a DIY on that because I think we need a focal point on our dining room table and I think that would go really good when I remake our dining room table but I want to do it beforehand just to see how it's going to look but I grabbed some things from the Target bullseye section that I haven't showed you guys yet but it's like this black vase. Let me grab it. this black vase right here and also I got this little tray from the bullseye section let me show you guys this little tray right here and I have the vase sitting on the on the tray and it just gave me so much inspo it's so dark over here but it just gave me so much inspiration you guys it really made me want to like do my table even more so yeah but it's almost time for rylan to wake up from her nap i am going to eat my little snack and i am going to do some work some um content planning for you guys but yeah drop down in the comments below if you guys have anything you want to see us do mommy and me or myself diy anything i am so open to ideas you guys and yeah okay you guys so rylan woke up from her nap we quickly ate some lunch we had some leftover chicken and rice that we had the other night we ate that for lunch and Rylan spilled her milkshake on us so hence the outfit changes okay but I did my laundry you guys and we ran out of fabric softener so we are on our way to Target because what's the vlog without a trip to Target right <laughs> So we are on our way to Target and I know I said it's just going to be kind of chill day. We're not going to be doing much. I did not plan to go out, but I didn't plan to run out of fabric softener either. But I'm figuring since we are over here by Target, I wanted to run to Home Goods really quick because I'm looking for a full length body mirror, like a full length mirror. And I'm going to check out Home Goods to see if they have it. I don't know why, but every time I go into Home Goods, you guys, I am not like your average person. I do not find anything in Home Goods, okay? I know everyone raves about Home Goods and everyone loves Home Goods, but it's one of those stores to where I'm like, I don't feel like searching for stuff. You know what I mean? Like, I like to go to a store and just see what I need right there. It has like a designated place. And I just feel like Home Goods is just too cluttered. It makes me claustrophobic. I start to get frustrated in Home Goods because, like, you really have to look. Like, Home Goods, Ross, Marshalls, stores like that, we don't do well. I don't like looking for stuff. Like, I like for my stuff to be right there, okay? But anyways, you guys, we're about to pull up to Target in a minute. Hopefully, I don't leave with anything else but fabric softener. <laughs> yeah, right. Let's put your bubbles right here, okay?
Okay, you guys, so we made it back home, and Home Goods was a bus, of course, which we already knew, but we went to Target, and I know I said I was only supposed to leave with fabric softener from Target, but Target was out of our fabric softener, so I did not want to waste a trip to Target. I decided to walk the toy out. They had something I've been looking for for a long time, so it was just meant to be okay. Rylan is a daredevil, and she likes to jump on the bed, so I found something much better than jumping on the bed because I'm just not about that life, okay? So I bought her this. I got Rylan this little Tykes trampoline jumper. It's small and compact. You can like fold it up and put it in a closet or store it away. Of course, I'm gonna have to find and make room because we are working with a small living space here, but I'm gonna go ahead and put this together for her because I know she is just so excited to jump on this thing here. So all you lucky ones, what up? You always on the run, what up? I mean, don't get me wrong, but what up? I was not the one, you yeah. Love. <laughs> 